What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be doing another video for Chris's Corner because as you can see Lex is not here with me. But in today's video I'm going to be doing another blush mark haul because you guys loved it the first time and I got more stuff to show you. We know that you guys haven't seen our faces for a while which is also why I am doing a Chris's Corner video because we have not uploaded in a little bit. Uh, but if you guys are not aware we are still in Ontario and all of Ontario is still locked down so Lex and I actually actually have not been able to see each other on a normal schedule like we used to to make our videos. So because of that, we have not been able to give you guys the content that we know you guys would want and love to see. So we've been stepping back just in order to make sure that when we are fully ready to come back and everything's open again, we can get right back to where we left off. Anyway, enough of that. Before we get into this video, please make sure you are clicking that like and subscribe button down below as well as turning on the notification bell so you are notified every single time we post a brand new video. Let's get into it. I got a bunch of new stuff this time to go over with you guys. Uh, no dresses or skirts this time around, but I do have a bunch of new shirts in style, some bathing suits and some accessories that I picked up. I'm not gonna be showing the bathing suits on, but I will be going over all of the sizing with you guys. So if any of you guys are looking to purchase any of the items you see today, I am 5'4 in height and I normally do fit a size medium. So every single thing that you see that's going on my body for clothing, is all a size medium just so you guys can be well aware of what it would look like if you guys were to purchase it at home. So first I got the Matilda Emily gold ring set. I really liked the way that these looked and I love gold accessories but I don't have anything that has any black in it. So I decided to pick these up. So this is what they look like up close and these are all of the rings that come with the set. Out of a 10 point scale, I'd probably say, obviously because they are a little more cheaply made, super great for pictures, but otherwise I'd probably put them at like a six or seven out of 10. Next, I got the Summer Eleanor black tinted lens frames and they come in this cute little case. It has almost like a little red velvet on the inside, which is kind of cute, a little flimsy, but uh, definitely worth it for the protection. Now, I definitely only got these because when I saw them, I thought that they were absolutely stunning. I don't necessarily think that I would wear them on a daily basis, definitely for like a photo shoot or something, but still super cute. Because like, honestly, if these are right on my face, I look like I'm straight out of like the Matrix movie or something. But I mean, other than that, 10 out of 10. Now, this next one, I was super excited for the Susan Elva White Bum Bag. As soon as I saw this, I was just like, yes, I finally found the fanny pack that I have been waiting for. So this is what it looks like on the hip. I honestly think that it looks absolutely amazing. 10 out of 10, way better than what I even thought it was gonna be in person, because sometimes you just never know. But white and gold is my absolute favorite thing, so I am super excited for this. Then with it around your back, it would look something like this. Next, I got the Blanca Alma Bustier in the color dark brown. Now, when I saw it online, I honestly thought that it was actually ribbed, but getting it in the mail now, I realize it's not. It's just the stitching, but still, even though it's a little bit of a thinner material, I actually really like it and I think it's super flattering. So I'm gonna give this, just for the material, a nine out of 10. Um, but yeah, otherwise, I'm excited to wear this. Next, I got the Bethel Eleanor cropped tank top, but in the color beige. So this one is also really super nice on and the material is a lot better than the first one. Uh, it's also really stretchy and I think I'm gonna give this one a nine out of 10 too. I also am not somebody who in the summertime normally wears t-shirts. I get super hot, so tank tops are where I live most of the summertime. So I think this is gonna go really well with everything that I already have in my closet. My next one, I'm trying on the Mary Eden light green tank top with rouge topping. Now for this one, I have to give this a 10 out of 10. Not only is it made really well, and it honestly makes me feel so comfortable, but the girls are happy, I'm happy, it's made really well, and it also fits super cute. Oh my goodness, I'm feeling myself in this, I like this. Mm -hmm. No more black in my closet. Now, this one was something I kind of couldn't resist, and you guys will realize why when I show you. 
It is technically called the Octavia L Black and Ginger Tank Top, but I'm just gonna call it what it is, and it's literally the written and directed by Quentin Tarantino tank top, which I have been longing for for years. I have seen so many different varieties and versions of this go out, and as soon as I saw this one, I was just like, that's it. That's the one. I'm doing it. So I'm doing it. It's here. <laughs> So here's what it looks like on. I honestly love it so much. And for those of you who don't know, I am an avid movie goer and lover. And honestly, film has just been such a big part of my life. And Quentin Tarantino is one of my favorite directors in the entire world. I have watched every single movie he has ever made. And so I'm going to be going to every single movie he makes in the future with this on now. That's my plan. And next I have the Ratchem Black Fair Jeans and I have also paired it with their white cropped hoodie which I've also been waiting for for a super long time. But the jeans, super cute, honestly. They fit really well. Paired it with my Gucci belt at home. Uh, honestly, made really nicely, feels like real denim. I like that on the bottoms. The flares have a little bit of a uh, niching off the side. And this is also super cozy, super homey. I'm also wearing a cropped tank from Blushmark as well underneath. So this entire outfit is from Blushmark. Now on top of the clothes, I did also get three new bathing suits from Blushmark as well. The first one is called the Ida Artha Black One Piece Swimsuit. So number one, the material on this made really, really well. Honestly, looks like a bathing suit that I would find anywhere else in store. This one comes with like a cross ribbed pattern and then the bottoms also all attached. So it's, it is a one piece, but it has like pieces cut out so you can kind of get that different definition look while you're wearing it, which is super cute. I also got the Joanna Elsa white and red bikini set. So that comes with the bikini top, which has a wired bottom underneath. I normally don't like wired bikinis, but I'm gonna give this one a try and see how it is. The bottoms also look really cute, really cheeky, really nice for the summer. So I'm kind of excited about those. And then it also comes with this really cute wrap. Isn't that gonna be so adorable? It just like goes around your waist. I think it's gonna look really good. And then finally, I also got their Bader Ella Black and Red Bikini set, but to me, if you guys don't know, I am obsessed and in love with Harley Quinn, and this literally reminded me of her so much I had to buy it. So this is what the top looks like, super cute, like old style Harley with the black and red. And then these are the bottoms, also super cute. These are honestly made really well. I highly recommend you guys go and get any of the bikinis or bathing suits from Blushmark. They even come with those waterproof tags that they're supposed to have. The material is super solid and I have never had an issue. So 10 out of 10 for all the bikinis, 100%. Anyway, that is it for this try on haul today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me for an episode of Chris's Corner today. We miss you guys all so much and we hope to be back really soon. But if you guys liked any of the items that I tried on or showed you today, they will all be linked below down in the description. And also make sure before you go, if you have not yet, click that like button, hit that subscribe button, and make sure that your bell notifications are turned on so you're notified to see our faces every single time we post. Thank you so much, and we will see you guys hopefully really, really soon.